build a wall between us We know they won't win We were touring with the Finn Brothers in Ireland um, about nearly two years ago now, and Nick got up and played with us three nights in a row, and it was that was great, great fun, and, and the audience loved it, and it was it was kind of a seed planted, and then uh, he came down and did a couple of gigs with us in Australia, and at the end of that, I said, "Let's, I've got some new songs. Do you want to come and play?" Yeah, well, every time you play with different people, there's a different um, aspect or character to it if you let people in, and. Uh, I have no choice letting Nick in to the songs because he only plays the way he plays. He doesn't play like Jaco Pistorius or who else? Who's a classic? Who's your classic bass P player? Pino Palladino. Pino Palladino. He doesn't Stanley play Clark. like those guys. He makes more mistakes, but he also has more character. Should I say that? They're probably great, those guys. Um, but yeah, so it's a band, you know, like in. It's not the experience of s sitting there and asking people to play what you want them to play. You get. In a band, you get people, they do what they do, and that is a surprise. You get things on there that are a surprise, and that's what character is. Part of the coming together of Neil and I was shared at Paul's funeral service, uh, where we, we, we had like you know, a really long p a day where we just played with all these all these musicians collected in Melbourne to uh, bid farewell to Paul. And uh, that was an incredibly intense musical day, really, uh, that, you know, we realised how many songs we know, how, how, much, uh, how much we enjoy playing with each other, how intuitive it is when we play together, and uh, we get a really good laugh out of it. And uh, that was also, you know part of the, the getting together musically that we had kind of lost touch with in a way. I'd like to see Bob Marley get back together. <laughs> <laughs> That'd be great. I know I'm really oh. regret not having ever seen. I did, I got to see them. Really? Yeah. Did you, you Festival, Hall, Festival Hall in Melbourne, it was a turning really? point for me. Yeah. Oh. Brilliant. I don't know why I didn't see it. I saw him drive down the King's Road in a BMW once. That's about as close as I ever got. <laughs> was he driving? I don't think so. I can't remember now. I just remember I can't seeing. Imagine Bob Marley driving. No. But Bob was better than the Beatles. That's what I. That's my thought for the day. But yeah. if you were to throw out, if I was thinking this last night in bed as I was struggling to find something, something to count, <laughs> to get myself to sleep, <laughs> I was thinking. B, if you own, if you threw out everything in your record collection that that, or if you only kept everything in your record collection that started with B, and you could include first names or second names, you'd have a lot of really good music, wouldn't you? There's a lot of good Bs out there: Bob Marley, Bob Dylan, Beatles, Beach yes. Boys, um, Brahms, Bach, Beethoven. Yeah. It's funny. I always think of that point where you're just on the last paddle and you've got your hand deep into the water for the last stroke and you're just putting your left hand on the nose of the board and stepping up onto the wave and taking off. That's the only way I can get to sleep. I can't count, can't have songs in my head, can't have to rid myself of all m mechanical patterns because patterns don't get me to sleep. But free-form surfing, definitely. I have to think okay, of the this greatest... Okay, interesting. Go great, greatest surf... Well, greatest waves I've ever caught. That sends me to sleep. Um... Last night I was playing, i was been employing all sorts of different methods to try and sleep, and I can't sleep to save my life, because I'm jet-lagged. Um, but I was playing very re calm, reflective, Eric Satie music and, on my computer, and, and kind of drifting, I'd feel it coming and feel it coming, a little woozy moments, and, and, then I, and then it stopped. And just as I was about to go to sleep, and I went, I, I'm going to fight that, I can do this, I can do this. And then, and I just fell asleep. And then in my sleep, I heard the, the same piece of Eric Sardi music really loudly, and it woke me up. But it was a dream. But it was a dream. <laughs> and uh, and dream I thought, oh, no, the computer started up again. It, just, it was like it had just started. Oh, I better turn that off. And then I thought, I'll have to turn it off. It's exactly what happened. And I woke up, like almost immediately, and it wasn't playing, and I couldn't get back to sleep again.
Fucking hopeless. Terrible. Anyway, then I tried the joint. That didn't work either. <laughs> I'm a Dixie Dick now. <laughs> Dixie cock. <laughs> didn't have to add that. There's no reason to do so. Well, that. if they're chicks. Well, that, that doesn't rhyme with chick. Oh, right. Dick does. Right, okay. See? That's why I'm the songwriter and you're the bass player. <laughs> you're a poet and you know it. Um, but yeah, no, that was a turn up for the books because I didn't really know a lot about the Dixie Chicks, but I had seen them perform on a benefit concert live on TV and I thought they were excellent. And, and also really liked the fact that she'd had a crack at George Bush, which was good. Well, it's a funny old world we live in when to associate with the Dixie Chicks is, is uh, going to put you on a black band, on a blacklist somewhere, isn't it? In a way, that's a funny old world we live in. No, I don't know. I think actually I, we're, I probably am banned from China as well because I did a free Tibet concert about four years ago. I think all the people that play those get... You've got to end up on a couple of blacklists or you're not really doing your job properly. <laughs> now I'm walking again To the beat of a drum I'm counting the steps to the door of your heart Only shadows ahead Barely clearing the roof Get to know the feeling of liberation and release Let's hear that, come on <laughs> 